The following video provides instructions on how to update the firmware on an HP LaserJet Enterprise Printer, or MFP, using a USB flash drive. If you are not sure if a firmware update is right for your LaserJet printer, check with your system administrator. These instructions work for a number of printers, and the steps will vary slightly depending on the type of control panel. This procedure requires access to the Device Maintenance menu. If the Device Maintenance menu is not available or is password protected, contact your system administrator. A USB flash drive is required to perform this procedure. For standard four-line displays, shown left, use the arrow keys to scroll and press OK to select. For touchscreen displays, shown right, use the scroll bar to scroll and touch the option to select. This procedure is a four-step process that requires you to print a configuration page, download the firmware to a USB flash drive, update the firmware from the control panel, and then verify the firmware update was successful. First, print a configuration page from the control panel. You will reference this later. On the control panel, scroll to and select Administration. Select Reports. Select Configuration Status Pages. Scroll to and select Configuration Page. On a four-line display, scroll up and then select Print. On a touchscreen display, select Print. Set aside the printed page. Next, download the firmware from HP's support website and save it on the USB flash drive. Go to www.hp.com forward slash go forward slash support. Click Drivers and Downloads. Type the HP LaserJet Enterprise printer name or number in the search box and click Go. Select the model from the list of search results. Select the preferred driver language. Scroll to the bottom of the page, and then select the Cross Operating System, BIOS, Firmware, Diagnostics, etc. option. Under the Firmware section, find the firmware file for multiple operating systems. Compare the current version date of the firmware file with the firmware date code on the configuration page that you printed previously to make sure that a firmware update is necessary. If the firmware date on the download page and the configuration page is the same, your printer firmware is up to date and you do not need to continue. If the firmware date on the configuration page is earlier than the date listed as the current version on the download page, continue with the firmware update process. Click Download. And click Save As. Note, depending on the browser type and version, this step might vary. Browse to the location where you want to save the file and click Save. Navigate to the location where you saved the file, right-click the zip, and then Extract All Files. Click Browse. Select the USB flash drive as the destination. Click OK. And then click Extract. After the files extract, a firmware file name with a .bdl extension is listed. This is the file required to perform the firmware update. Now, update the firmware from the control panel. Make sure the printer is in a ready state. If the printer is in an error state, resolve the error before proceeding. On a four-line display, press the down arrow or press OK to open the main menu. On a touchscreen, start at the home screen by pressing the home icon. Scroll to and select Device Maintenance. Select USB Firmware Upgrade. When prompted to insert a USB, locate the USB port on the front of the printer. This location varies slightly, but is typically located at the base of the keypad or touchscreen display. If there is a port cover, remove it. 
insert the USB flash drive into the USB port. Select the .bdl file or bundle and then select Upgrade or press OK. Wait for the firmware update to complete and for the device to reboot automatically. This process can take up to 10 minutes or more. Do not interrupt this process by unplugging, disconnecting, or attempting to turn off the printer. Doing so can damage the printer. When the device returns to a ready state, verify that the firmware update was successful. Print another configuration page using the steps performed earlier. From the Administration menu, select Reports. Select Configuration Status Pages. Select Configuration Page and select Print. Compare the firmware date on the configuration page with the firmware date on the download page at hp.com. If the versions match, then the update was successful. It is now safe to remove the USB flash drive. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com forward slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash hp printer support.